What's up guys, T-Mart here, and the Call of Duty World War II beta is definitely hiding a secret. I'm on the trail, I'm trying to figure out exactly what's going on, I'm not quite there yet, but we're definitely getting somewhere, and I wanted to share this with you guys because it's kind of exciting, it's definitely some sort of hint, or you know, something leading up to something big for this game, I'm assuming for the campaign. And uh, it's just kind of fun. It's a little Easter egg type deal. So if you guys don't know, there are actually secret placards hidden on each of the maps in the beta. So like, for example, right here on Gibraltar, if you run over to the cliff side, you guys can see there's a placard here on this post. Now, what on earth could these codes be for? Well, it turns out they're for Spotify. It's kind of like a QR code but for Spotify, which I didn't know was a thing, but Spotify can read them and it gives you information back when you scan it. So credit where credit is due, Ryan or Prestigious Key is the first person I saw talking about this. So I'm gonna link his video down in the description. Great job, dude. But I'm gonna show you guys exactly how this works. You guys can actually do this right now in this video. So I've got my phone here and I've got it open on Spotify. And what we're gonna do is we are gonna go to search we're gonna go to the camera button up here. You guys can see it brings up my camera and you can hold it over that image, which I'll display the image on screen for you guys. And look at this, we've got folder A by Call of Duty World War II and it's got intercept able. We're gonna go ahead and play this thing and see what it says. Attention, attention. We who are prosperous must break all ties. I repeat. We who are prosperous must break all ties. If you can hear this transmission, répondez s'il vous plaît. The leopard spot are now in motion. Vive la résistance. So obviously they're talking in code here and that's what we've got to break if we want to find out exactly what's going on. They're talking about how all who are prosperous must break all ties and the leopard spots are now moving and you know, viva la resistance and stuff like that. I mean, obviously this is the French resistance, but what in the world are they talking about? I have no clue at this point. So we're gonna move on to the second intercept, Intercept Bravo, which you can find on the map Point de Hoc. It's in the farmhouse right here behind the sink. Dispatch received. Action, this on Argentine. I breaking all ties. Please advise on operations order. Focus on Tiger's eyes and ears or her stripes. So this guy sounds stressed. You know, it's it's quick, it's fast. There's a lot of disruption and, and disturbance and stuff. I don't know if they're currently being attacked in that situation or not, but it does not sound like he's in a comfortable position. He's talking about focus on the tiger's eyes and ears or even her stripes. Like I, I literally have no clue what's going on here. But if we move on to the third and final intercept, we've already covered Gibraltar and Point to Hawk. This one's gonna be on Arden Forest. If you go inside the MG nest, Underneath the table with all the radio equipment, that's where you find the final code. All spots should target the stripes. Reports confirm tigers are most susceptible when they are drinking water. All those who are prosperous, break your ties from now until the leopard wakes. We fight together. Pour la main patrie. Pour le monde. All spots should target the stripes. Reports confirm that tigers are most susceptible when drinking water. All right, so I, I think I'm starting to kind of understand what's going on here. Now, granted, I am not a history buff. I'm not the most well-versed person in World War II history, so some of you guys probably know a heck of a lot more than I do. But um, what I'm getting here is obviously this is the French resistance, and the French were a huge part of the war for the Allies. I mean, they're still one of the U.S.'s biggest allies even today. So um, they played a big role in fighting back against the Germans. 
And I think that's what they're talking about here. I think the spots are like the, the French or the, you know, all the allies. And they're saying attack the Germans when they're next to water. Well, what water attack did we have? Obviously, D-Day, the beaches of Normandy in France. And even on the Spotify playlist, you guys can see we've got pictures of the ocean. So I think this is some sort of code talk for the events that were kind of leading up to the invasion of Normandy and D-Day and, and kind of the, the last steps in the war. You know what I mean? Because, I, I mean, it, the French were like, they were good for manpower. Like, they did a lot of fighting, but they were also really good for, you know, different sabotage missions and reconnaissance and spying and stuff like that. So I think this is their code of they figured out that the Germans are weak on the beaches of Normandy and it's time for everybody to attack. That's like the last piece of this puzzle that we haven't really seen much of up until this point for World War II. I mean, if you guys notice that, like usually campaign is the first thing that they tease for Call of Duty games. And we haven't seen like a full campaign gameplay mission yet. We've seen multiplayer. We've had a teaser for zombies, but that's it. Like we, we, we haven't had anything for campaign. So maybe they're gearing up for a campaign reveal. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see what happens. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to catch you guys later. Peace out.